tortoise and the hare. One day, Emma was playing with her soft toys. Grandma asks, "What are you playing with, Emma?" This is tortoise, and this is hare. It was late, and Emma wasn't asleep. This concerned Grandma, so she decides to tell her a story. Emma, how about I tell a story about tortoise and hare? Emma gets excited. Grandma starts telling her the story. A long time ago, there was a tortoise and hare. The hare always mocked tortoise for his slowness. Do you ever get anywhere? The hare asked with a mocking laugh. Humble tortoise replied, "Yes, and I can get sooner than you think." The hare mocks the tortoise again by saying, "I am the fastest runner, and you are the slowest one." The fox, who was watching hare and tortoise the whole time, comes over to give them an idea to decide who is fastest. How about you both run a race? The hare liked the idea of running a race. The tortoise agreed too. Both agree to fox's idea of race. The fox claims to be the judge for the race. Soon the race starts, and the hare speeds past tortoise in a flash. The hare was way ahead of the tortoise when he spots a field of cabbages. The hare looked back and could hardly see the tortoise. Hare thinks to himself, he could still win the race even if he took a small break for breakfast. After eating up a cabbage, the hare looked around. To see how far the tortoise got, the hare sees that the tortoise hasn't even come halfway, and it decided to take a nap as it felt sleepy. The hare thought to himself, "I will have a quick snooze now, and when I wake up, I will quickly run past the finish line." Hare fell into a deep sleep, and dreamed of winning the race. Time passed, and the sun was already setting when the hare woke up. The hare jumped and looked around to see the tortoise was just a few steps away from the finish line. The hare rushed towards the finish line as fast as he could, but the tortoise. Crossed it first, winning the competition. The tortoise wins the race and says, "You don't have to be the fastest to win." While the hare was sobbing in disgrace, Emma, now happy listening to the story, sleeps hugging the tortoise and the hare, where Grandma says. Slow and steady wins the race. The end.